and friends, Cosmo Turtle here, bringing you the continuation of my Fable Anniversary playthrough, which is a mastered as an Xbox 360 game being played on an Xbox One. It covers, well, it's on an Xbox One X, if that matters. So yeah, so this now is going to be the Twin Blade section, so I've just gone into the camp. Good playthrough, so I'm not going to be killing Twin Blade. But before I continue, my hair is being an asshole, and I need to take off my mic and fix my hair. Two seconds. I'm gonna talk to you again. You gonna talk to me? Oh, hello, mate. <laughs> nice bandit gear. Oh, cheers! I found out my way here. This here is Twin Blades Camp. It's my camp now. Once you're in, you're in for good. Another one yeah, coming another in, John. Open the gates. All right then. If I remember correctly, at this point, there's a few options you can uh, you can go for like um, get the pass to get through the door that way. <coughs> get the achievement. Get that game. Through the way. You charge. I kind of started this part of the game well okay, so we need to pass sure. Do this which will no don't you around I expect you don't after the inner sanctum yet. right it's the inner sanctum where you gotta free the prisoners and stuff. Tell you what I'm feeling generous General. If you can beat me at a game of Guess the Edition, you can have this spare pass. I won off some other idiot. Oh. Come back and talk to me when you're ready to play. Alright. Right. Oh shit, that's slightly terrifying. I'm ready to play. Play. Those bandits are getting more and more powerful. It doesn't look good. <sighs> All right, let's. Psst. I've uh, heard you might be interested in procuring a camp pass. Yes. Well, I can get you one, but it'll cost you a thousand gold. No. If you want it? I'll be here. This guy's already costing me money. There we go, he's sitting down now. It'd be good to get him on our side. Alright. Instructions, just so we can. To win at Spot the Edition, you must complete several rounds in a set amount of time. Each round consists of two phrases, uh, phases, not phrases. First, you are presented with a set of objects to memorize. When you feel you have memorized the objects, press the A button. The objects will be covered and, addition no, and an additional object added. When the object is presented again, you must guess which item is new by pressing the... Yeah, yeah, okay. So, pick the item, I think. Alright, let's go. We're just going to bet one gold, because I can't be asked, just in case I fuck up. Okay. A book, an apple, and mushrooms. A book... Apple and mushrooms. A book, apple and mushrooms. So this one mushroom is the odd one. Nothing standing around like this. Book, balverine, bottle, and a hob. I think that's a hob. I'm classing that as a hob. Book, balverine, bottle, and a hob. Book, balverine, bottle, and a hob. It's that. Alright, that was good. Right. A bottle, a balverine, a shoe, a book, board, board, it's a mushroom. Board. I wanna kill something. Book. A bottle, a balverine, a shoe, a book, and a mushroom. Right. A bottle, a balverine, shoe, book, and some mushrooms. Right? It's the wasp. You're out of time. Oh what? They even tied me while I'm 
Okay, I gotta be much quicker. My bad. Fish skull shoe. Board, no, go back. Board, board. I wanna kill something. Mm, right. Hob powdering apple flowers. <clears throat> right, isn't it? You gotta go left and right to move. You can't actually. Apple fish sword book something. Apple fish sword book. Must be a magic oh, bottle. Things. Why can't I move? Are we gonna spill some good soon or what? All right, let's just go for gold. Risk it. It's you. Damn it! It was that fish, wasn't it? I saw one last time. I knew I should have taken a second longer to memorize it. Alright. <coughs> the first one's fine. With the first. Uh, okay. Shoe, sword, mushrooms, and moss. Shoe, sword, like mushrooms, and moss. Balverin skull, shoe, wasp, tombstone. Flowers. Hope, bottle, apple, mushrooms, sword, tombstone. Apple, mushrooms, bottle, shoe, sword, flowers. And board, something. board, board! I wanna kill something! Fuck! I thought I seen that. It must have been the sword on the side. It looked the same to me. My days. I got quicker than it as well. I was proper on the ball, on that. All right, let's try it again. I need to take a little bit more time on the last round. Skull hob wasp. Sword. I'm already on it. All right. Book hob bottle stone. Tombstone. Are we gonna spill some good soon or what? Wasp, book, hob, bottle, tombstone. Book, wasp, hob, bottle, tombstone. So it's this thing. Hob, balverine, bot, book, flowers, skull. Hob, uh, it's the fish again. Alright, last one. Skull, balverine, hob, fish, apple, Mushrooms bottle. We're not earning the shoe. Standing around like this. Look at that, less than 20 seconds. You're the first bandit I've ever seen with the brains to beat my game. In fact, are you sure you're even a bandit? Uh, of course, oh, I am. Well, never mind. I said you would win my pass if you beat me. So here it is. Thank you. Alright guys, we'll do that one normally, and now the next one, we're gonna kill all the bandits. If you don't have a pass, looks like a valid pass to me. And you go. Well, Thank you kindly. Fimblades elite camp. I'm an elite. Oh look at that! I'm raising through the ranks like, like they're nothing basically. PlayStation Live. Oh, PlayStation access will be live soon. Can I break these without them trying to kill me? Kill them all. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we're gonna kill all the barrels. Don't you worry. Talk to Roderick. He deals with the scruffy public. Oh, dare you! Actually, time to die. You shall regret that, my friend. Edwin, keep him busy while I clap the back of his head. <coughs> Do you want to be assassinated? I get the feeling I should not have angered the bandits. Holy shit, that was a lot of damage from one hit. 
No, 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 please don't. Don't do this to me now. Target the ones trying to kill me. I am so underprepared for this. Did it. Oh, we did it. Yeah, after this. <laughs> after I beat Twin Blade, I think before I continue on in the um, the main story, I need to do some side quests, kill some things, and level up my characters like everything basically, because he is so not prepared for this. What are we aiming at? Get rid of some careless bandits, but you know, or banditos, if you will. Which way are you facing? All right, so go for this one now. Ah, shit, you see me. Run! Why are you? F ah, no, not him. Yeah. Stupid targeting system. Yes, I know my health is low. Why am I? Oh my god. Honestly, it's really annoying because up until this play for now that I'm recording, I literally. I think I've died once, maybe, in like three playthroughs of this game. And now that I've like basically rushed myself to, for recording purposes, I don't know why I rushed myself. I'm having more deaths on one playthrough than I've ever had in like. Multiple playthroughs. Oh shit, what was that? Oh, they're sending in the lads. Well done. The gate is open. You can go to Twin Blades area now. Ah, uh, fucking lock on to the right thing. Go through the gate into Twin Blades. Shut area. up, you! Can't you see the free elite bandits after me? If you did something around you other than warn the hero that his health is low, you'd understand. Why the hero's health is low. Go through to Twin Blades area. Wait, my fucking skull's gonna go through your head's area now if you don't shut up. And yes, I'm aware I'll have to equip a sword for that because I have an axe right now. Come on, through the gate. I'm just gonna ignore him. Do it unfair. Give me my experience. Oh, money. Go through the gate. Just point the way. Kill, kill, kill. Is he dead now? Come on, through the gate. I don't get why the game is so fucking annoying when it comes to like making the guild master relentlessly talk. Come on, through the gate. 
Why aren't you through the gate yet? The gate over there, you know. And you, as the hero, should go through it. Because it is the hero's gate to walk through. Bing. There's enough of that. Oh, I'm trapped. Aha! Come on, through the gate. Fuck off! Seriously, you're pissing me off. Roll. Roll. No, I seriously need to check if that um, axe thing I just picked better than what I'm currently using, because this axe is shit. Just melee weapons, steel picker. My obsidian great axe, which I'm just way too uh, weak to. Oh, it says heavy. So yeah, that will be too heavy for my character as well. But nowhere near as strong as my other option for heavy weapons I can't use. Need someone to watch your back. Just point the way. Come on, through the gate. Fuck off, honestly. This is ridiculous. Shut up. Let me enjoy what's me doing. Past the lads. And they've Go come for the their fist fighting comp on the on. We're in the middle of a clash. Yeah, I'll probably do a video of that on its own. Like I'll just fight um, all four or five of them. I think the first one you have to do is the Bowerstone one, I believe. And if I remember correctly, the knot hole yeah, one is the final one you go for. Stand back, lads! Twinblade wants a word with this little hero! To be fair, my character is quite a little hero. There's no denying that. I'm completely underprepared for this fight. I'm gonna have to use all me guile to avoid him. Sonic booms and flash kicks never attend. You're made of. How long is back? Is there a tattoo or a cut? We did not. Did that not hurt him? Interesting. I remember now. Oh, fuck me, look what's down. What'd you go? What'd you go? What'd you go? I'm literally doing like almost no damage to him. Right, since the whole point of this fight is to dodge and then hit, I'm gonna try this equipping my obsidian great axe and see if the um, see if that will make a difference. Since the speed I need to fight doesn't really matter here. Obviously, I need to take it out only when I need to attack. Better 
Star Wars over there. Oh shit. Ah. Well, it has a, a, a much bigger chunk in one hit, doesn't it? So, I suppose you can't really call it worse. Ah! Don't blade, you're cheating! I think that's one thing that upsets me about Fable. The more of the franchise you play, the more you realise how they kind of reuse their own ideas. <clears throat> like in Fable 1 and Fable 3, you fight the leader of the bandits in like a ringed arena similar to this. I can't remember the guy's name. Though. Well, it's even in Fable 2, you fight Fang, the leader of the bandits. So they always make you fight the bandit leaders like the first real boss. There we go. Oh, they all started running at me. Andrew's here. <laughs> Finish it quick, then. I do the same for you. There you are. What's wrong? Don't you recognize your own sister? No. Her past once again before her. Teresa's memories returned in a blaze of fire. Oakvale was burning. She, she watched in silence as the bandits tortured her memory. mother, then turned to her with questions of the missing boy. She answered them only with a stare, and so their leader sliced out her eyes. Oh. It's nice, isn't it? The raiders took the boy's mother and left Teresa alone in the forest. There she crawled for three days, blind and desolate, until she was found by bandits, Twinblade and his men. She began a new life of servitude among their clan. But the bandit king sensed her exceptional strength and power of will and listened as she whispered dark prophetic truths in her sleep. Those who could never accept this small, blind girl standing by their master's side did not last long. When they attacked, she killed them without mercy and without emotion. For this was her place in the world now. An assassino. For the twin of the blades. I like how they give you this bit before making I've you have the option so of killing him. Because so if kill. you choose to kill him, so you think, oh, he done all this. Then it's like, oh, he kind of, of sand didn't. And blood. An arena full of secrets. And I've seen the choice you'll have to make one day between the darkness and the light. Teresa. I'm sorry, Twinblade. Your path is alone now. All our paths are. But before I leave, brother, I have a present for you. For all the birthdays I've missed. Aww. The power that runs in our family. So kind. Oh no! <laughs> ah, I've become a sage. I can now uh, absorb in the nature the chakra. Fits. That's what what are you was. waiting for? Finish it, or leave me alone. I'm dead anyway. I'm no one's king anymore. Well, I, I want to loot your camp. I don't want to kill you. Let's just, uh, just ignore him for a moment and. Uh, Oh yeah, now that... Oh, shut up, mate. I can put this away now, because... I don't need that damage boost. Uh, the axe is not the longest one, is it? Barring 
the two heavy ones. Right, a part of me thinks there's a silver key here. But I'm gonna risk it and open the chest too and I just really hope I don't get a silver key. That's a good one, that's a good one. Alright, come on. Hey, no silver keys in sight. You see something? No, just more barrels for breaking. Bye bye, Twin Blade. Enjoy your life as not being a king anymore. is no longer the king in the north. <clears throat> right, so You're that quest is done now. Enough to use the scary laugh expression. <laughs> you have reached familiar status. I am no familiar. That was a very impressive victory, hero. But no one has more news for you at the guild. I suggest you return here at once. Or tell me you to eat a, a carrot. Oh, I never want. Check the guild for more quests. Ah, this is that cage I was on about where you can free someone. Looks like anything could have happened to them now since I didn't go save them. Right, before we continue on with any story, as I stated, I'm gonna power up my character. Um, I won. So what are these? These are my current quests. This is request. Chicken kicking. Sharp plus gone. No, I want to, um... What's it called? I want to find the temple up. Because <coughs> before I power up my character's attack and stuff, I, I'm not sure if it is the case. But I remember the first time I played this game. And I didn't know how to pull the sword out of the stone, like or what kind of strength I needed to have to do it. The internet told me it depends on how much you use, like how much strength you have. What the fuck, I'm doing. Uh, the first time you try to pull the sword out. So apparently, if you go there with full strength, you'll never be able to pull it out, which I think is bollocks. But I don't want to risk it. Something? No, I don't need you anymore. You can go. I'll go then. Yes, you will. Need someone to watch your back? No, I just got rid of you. Right. So I'm gonna set up. I'm gonna go to the guild now to start off with. Grab my two nukes. Literally seen. And then from there, I'm gonna try and um work out where the bloody sword in the stone is. Hopefully do like a side quest or something. Okay, so I pop here. Oh, oh I can do the hobby This ends in 15 minutes. I should probably check out what this is. Excuse. I will take the quest because we'll save the traders. But yes, that's the plan. Then we're gonna find the uh, the sword. And then we're gonna do those two side quests. At this, like, for this video itself, I'm on like um, a very tight schedule because I have like basically the video has to end the moment my girlfriend gets back home because we have plans to go out. Looking fine. You look strong. So I'm sorry if that uh, causes an inconvenience. Hey. Oh, that reminds me. I can go do um, go fish out that purple, not purple, the blue mushroom as well. What's down here? No, that's the park or the picnic, isn't it? So we want to go this way. 
to go to the woods. I can't even like picture it when I look at the map. Must be by the, the Great Lake maybe. Maybe it's a direction I haven't chose from there. I'm sure the bandits here are substantially weaker than like the ones at Twin Blades Camp. I wonder why my bandit outfit doesn't fool the bandits. But it did fool the Twin Blade bandits. Alright, before we continue. So look, do I have any better outfits? No. Nope. I feel like I'm taking a lot of damage. Are the assassin's trousers have less rate armor. Oh. I was not expecting that, gotta say. Oh, here we go. Clever boots. Give me a little bit more armor. Oh, I can just do outfits. Right, okay. So basically the same as I was a second ago. Of new boots. That's my man. It's one of my favourite uh, <laughs> fable ones. Oi. I was going to allow you to live. But then you went and spoiled it all by doing something stupid like attacking me. Alright, is this a pathway to a place? I can't see where I am on the map. No. It is a treasure chest. Fingers crossed, it's not a silver key. Yeah. Look, can I take anything of his? As grim as that sounds. Oh, I did. I did. Oh, I took something else as well. I'm pressing it too quick, I can't see what I'm taking. Alright, we know for a fact it's not an orchard farm. Hey, money. I'll save you! Mysterious stranger. That's the way to do it, man. I think we can do a special Voyager. Oh, we can get some hairstyles on the go. Right, what we got? The warrior stripe. Bald. Oh. Well, I have long hair. Wait. A ponytail increases your scariness. Oh, fuck it. Having a ponytail. The foreign moustache. My scariness. Seems slightly racist. Here, you want to see Maze in the guild? How do you? How, how the hell do you know that? <laughs> Fisher Creek. That is not where we want to go. Not yet. Anyway, we'll do that later. Where we, the guys, are like, oh, catch the biggest fish you can, and I'll give you a lollipop, a silver key. <coughs> ah, shit, wrong button. Why did I click RT to attack? How they asked the voice actors to do that weird like, oh, noise. Like, oh, what's the motivation you give them? What like? How do you describe that sound? Oi! 
Oh, did not mean to do lightning. I forgot I had magic. Oh, where we got a bit? Where's this take me to? Orchard farm. So we don't want to go to that one then. We want to go here. This. Ah, oh, shit, that's orchard farm. Because I'm pretty sure um, where I want to go now is near where the arena is. Well, not the cool arena from Oblivion, the slightly less cool arena, because you can only do it once. If you could go through it multiple times, then this would be just as good as the arena from Oblivion. Which, on that note, completely unrelated, but when they do the next L6, whatever they call it, I really hope they have an arena in there as well. Th like, that was one of the only things I felt Skyrim needed. This. The warning signs have been... Sc oh, yeah, because I killed all the banditos. So there's nothing to worry about here anymore. Yeah, so this is a one-way area, so... I haven't got to worry about going the wrong way here. Demon door over there. But I'm going to do all the demon door. Um, I'm probably going to hold off on the demon doors, though, because... I'm trying now to sort out a couple months to, like, get myself a nice laptop. Uh, not laptop, a uh, PC. And my friend has offered to help me, like, build a PC. So all the nonsense and not post, like, an hour the two hour video of me going through the demon doors and have it down to a nice like 20 minute half an hour video for you everyone would greatly appreciate that or as low and small as I can make it within reason like if I can drop it down to 15 minutes and you still get all the information for opening the demon doors as well as me showing you how to do them and what's inside we'll try to do that but obviously I've never edited a video so you'll have to uh, bear with me and not laugh at my inks <coughs> oh well you can laugh my incompetence I suppose if you want but just don't maybe not laugh directly at me and let me know you're laughing at me would be appreciated oh dear oh dear oi charging up a powerful shot on it ah see that's where I'm going wrong I just I'm getting killed for stupid reasons and I know it's because I don't have enough health But I want to find the sword in the stone before I boost my strength up too high. Honestly, lads, once I've been to that stone, you are all going to regret attacking me and killing me. I'm going to fucking strangle you. I'm going to crush you. Okay, see, off with his fucking head. Yeah, the worst case scenario though, if I don't manage to get the uh, the sword in this video, I will get there in my own time, but then I will continue the playthrough from the moment I find the stone, like the sword. Oh, you know what? We're just gonna we're just gonna run past them. There's no real reason to need to kill the hobs or any of these creatures. I know, obviously, there's experience, so I can level up. Sure, if I just fast traveled to um, Oak Vale, I'd be able to get there quicker. Oh shit, he's probably wants to kill me, doesn't he? A special offer for you, sir. No way. Uh, run away! The Balvarine is still here. Got with that still looking like a champ. <laughs> there now. No, it's still going to be worth my time. I think if I even if I flip in. No, oh, isn't it? Let me first check what's here. Because there's two options here. 
And if this one by here doesn't appear to be the right way, then I'm just going to fast travel to Oakfield. What's this? Oh, I went inside it. Where am I? Darkwood Bordello. I see. Oh, shit, I'm in the brothel. Oh, I've long prayed someone from the guild would come and... But I'm forgetting my manners. <laughs> my name is Madame Minge. Welcome to the famous Madame what? Darkwood Bordello. Min <laughs> Madame Minge. Please, walk with me. Minge. As you can see, the Bordello is a haven of calm and pleasure in a perilous world. Weapons and spells are forbidden here. Men what about spells of calm and pleasure? To escape their worries and responsibility. Well, we've got problems of our own. Mr. Grobe, the current owner, he's what you might call a cruel, sadistic, self-absorbed despot. He treats the girls good. like slaves, little better than animals. Most of them have nowhere else to go, of course. If only we could find the Bordello Deeds. But I'm sure you don't want to hear all this. Please, enjoy your stay. If I do remember correctly, which I'm pretty sure I do, there's actually an achievement in this game. Oh, look at that. Demon door. Sort of treasure chest. For sleeping with all of the prostitutes. I think there's like... I'm going to guess between 5 and 7. Which, just for giggles, I think I might make a video on it. Just because... The sex in Fable games is just hilarious. At least it is in Fable 2. I can't remember Fable 3. Probably the same as Fable 2, to be fair. And I... I can kind of remember this a little bit. I, like the only bit I remember is I remember some woman who has like a flipping torture bed, <laughs> which is just ridiculous. Okay, yeah, we're gonna fast travel out of here now and go to Oakfield. What time is it? Yeah, oh, sorry. Right. Oh, we got lucky. I thought my time was up then. Right. So we're at oh, no. Right, right, right. Just need to try to remember where it is. So we're at Barrow Fields. Who is this? Around about Barrow Fields. Hmm. Yeah, there are two ways to go here, so I'll see which of my two options. Because I know if I go back like one or two more, I can work my way around to the um, the shadow, the shadow cult, or whatever it's called in this game. But I'm pretty sure this is not the way. The grey house. Yeah, that's not. Oh, well, I guess dark when you go over there, didn't it? Where is this? It'll take us to dark wood. No, it's definitely not dark wood. Right, let's have a look. So we got. We can go back to the dark wood lake. And how far is the dark wood lake from? Quite a bit actually. Alright, okay, let's let's go here. Maybe there's a second way around. I'm just forgetting some. Because to be fair, the lake is like... Where are we? One, two, three... Three or four areas away from where I am. No, there's only one way out here. Oh, we'll have a check. It's a wisp. Or an imp, whatever they call them in this one. Like the ancient colour skate, this looks like a good spot where they could 
have uh, the forked pathways have it split enough. So I know it's not because from Bowerstone you go to the Bowerstone prison. <coughs> no, this is not the answer either. Okay, I'll go to the other way from the um, the camp, but I know the other way from the camp will take me to um, wherever the Shadow Guild of Cult or whatever it's called, League of Shadows, which is Batman, Dark Brotherhood, which is obviously Elder Scrolls, the Temple of Shadows, is that what it's called? The, te the Temple of Avo. Temple of Scorm. That's the one. Alright, so if we go up here, no, my bad, that takes us back, I need to go Ancient Colour Skate, so yes, this way, will take us to the Temple of Scorn, Chapel of Scorn, right, well this is loaded, I'm, I'm just going to check to see where the Chapel of Avo, or whatever it's called in this game is, I, I literally have no memory, I, I cannot for the life of me remember where it is. We're not gonna like do anything here, not for the moment anyway. We'll open this. Able. Avo. Temple. There's the assassin's shirt. There's a temple in Witchwood. Alright, how do I get to Witchwood? Oh shit. Let's bring up the old teleportation and let's see if I've got an option to go to somewhere called Witchwood. Do not. How do I make it to Witchwood? Mm. That means I apologize for this. Alright. Alright, minute. Table. To get to. How to get to Witchwood? What's the soonest you can get to Witchwood? Yeah, we go. That's a good idea. Alright, okay, apparently I have to do the find the archaeologist. So maybe I gotta accept a quest that will help me get there. You wanna do, as I already made clear. We'll go to the guild now, see if I have a story mission. Because I gotta talk maze again, so we'll talk. But my video is re hour mark, which means we are running desperately low on time at this point. I'm running. Where am I going? That's not where Maze is. He has his own quarters because he's a fancy pants. Out of me way! I need to look online to find out if Maze is actually the like the leader of the guild or if the guild master is. Because Maze was called the head of the guild, and he's the head, and he's the guild master. Both sound like positions of the leader. Hello, Maze. So, you really found your sister? <laughs> I'd never have imagined her living among bandits. You've really come a long way these last few years, haven't you? People are starting to ask when they'll see you in the arena, out in Witchwood. But before you go wandering again, I've left a quest card of my own. A favour, if you will. An old friend of mine has gone missing, calls himself the Archaeologist. He may have stumbled onto something big, perhaps big enough to put his life in danger. There's a rumour <coughs> that he may be hiding somewhere in Witchwood. That is, if he isn't dead already. You can use a Cullis Gate to get there. I only hope it isn't too late.
You've received a new quest. Yeah, okay, so I wasted I think it's like 15 20 minutes of the video, maybe. If I just went and accepted the bloody quest, I'd be there right now. Uh, I, I want to take this opportunity to apologize for anyone who actually watched all that bit for the purpose of why I d recorded it. I want to apologize for wasting your time. Oh shit, no, I don't want to do the trader massacre. Check the guild! Can I just fast travel to now then? It was which would, wouldn't it? Oh, that's why you can't get the island. And this hero don't ride no stinking boat, apparently. Hooray, money for just fast traveling. Rumor has it that somewhere in Witchwood there is a sword that only a true hero can acquire. I am a true hero. There is a temple in Witchwood that is supposed to give spiritual strength. Be warned. Some gods can be fickle. I am a fickle god. Wait a minute. Ah, uh, I'm afraid our time is up. We nearly got there. So I'll just continue right from here now in the next video. I hope you enjoyed. Please like if you did. If you really enjoyed and would like more content like this daily. Take care and I'll catch you in the next video.